Schnitzelberg neighborhood is getting ready to welcome the newest member of the culinary scene. Hop Atomica, a brewery and restaurant, is getting ready to open later this week. And our Sam Carter is live there this morning, giving us a little preview before it opens. Yeah, guys, a little bit of a preview before they open 5 p.m. on Friday. I got Paul here with me. He was in me in the last one. Pull that out for me, Paul, because... Uh, full disclosure, my pizza, um, I may or may not have accidentally created the very first calzone in Hopatomica history. Um, again, these guys open Friday. Now, one of the things that these people do just about, uh, one of the things they're hanging their hat on anyway, is the pizza. And, of course, what goes with pizza better than a little beer? And the, one of the other owners here, this is Kenneth. Um, Kenneth. This just came right out of the oven. It looks amazing. Now, many people won't know because this isn't a huge space. All of the beautiful brews we're seeing next to this uh, pizza, you guys make in-house. Before we do anything, tell me what we got on this little, uh, this really cool little uh, take on a flight that you guys have done. Yeah, absolutely. So, um, starting right here, we've got our cookies and cream pastry stout. Love that. Uh, moving around, we've got our Belgian-style wit beer, um, our American IPA and then our Hefeweizen. And I kind of jumped the gun because uh, this pizza, this is not your everyday pizza. Mm. A lot of the stuff on here is extra special. Underneath the beautiful kind of uh, charcuterie that we have on here <laughs> is a cheese. Tell me about the cheese that's on here and then we'll get to the rest of it. So yeah, so all of our cheese um, is actually gonna be 95% lactose free. Whoa. So that means if you're lactose intolerant, you can still eat our pizzas. And then the bacon that's on here, that was added late by Paul because he's the man. Uh, talk to me about that a little bit because it just goes in with the, as your word, intentionality of everything mm -hmm. that happens here. Yeah, so um, as much as possible, we want to use locally sourced ingredients. So the bacon we've got on our classic is uh, Kentucky Broadbent bacon that we have sourced locally. Yeah. It's so cool. It is so cool. Guys, again, they make everything here. Well, before we leave, this, uh, this orange peel here mm -hmm. is a little different. Talk to me about that. So we, um, that's actually been dehydrated here in-house. All of our ingredients are uh, super fresh. We make our own juices in-house. Um, all the ingredients you'll see in like our cocktails and like the garnishes and everything so like that, we make here. It's so yeah. neat. Guys, we are going to be at Hopatomica all day. Intentionality. The word of the day for these guys. Can't wait to show you more of that intentionality as we get rocking. I need a pizza cutter. Breakfast. Yeah, let's get that here. going. Let's yeah. roll. Let's slice that up. It looks so good. So yummy. Some would say too pretty to eat, but we say dive right oh. in. Pizza for <laughs> breakfast, Matt. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll eat that pretty pizza. Looks good. No doubt, right? For breakfast, that looks good. Let's talk about what may not be so great. That